want to search the area to your left and right as you try and walk as much of a straight line as you can. Getting their last minute instructions, volunteers got ready to begin the search for 79 year old John Matson, united by a desire to help. It's just very sad to see a man you know, go for a walk and disappear. And, and I, my heart goes out to the family. You know, we both understand how scary it can be. It's family, so the fact that he's been missing for three months without a trace, that's tragic. Matson, who suffers from dementia, was last seen back on July 6th. His daughter organizing today's search. Want to put an end to this, um, have some closure. If we find him today or the next couple of days, that will be good. The volunteers were concentrating their search efforts in a wooded area off of West Road. While there have been searches done in the past, those were done in the middle of the summer. His daughter is hoping now that the leaves have started to fall, they'll be able to cover more ground, get a clearer picture of what's in the woods. Mindful of the fact that it is hunting season, the volunteers made sure they were wearing some item with blaze orange or bright colors. Even as the search was conducted in the woods, the family says there could be another alternative. If he's out there in like a shelter or something in another town, um, we're hoping that somebody will identify him and get him back to us. Hill says her dad's birthday is Monday, so it seems appropriate to search now. And she and her family are so grateful for everyone who turned out. It brings a lot of hope. In Hampstead, Ray Brewer, WMUR News 9.